Well, hello everybody, and welcome back to uh, Farmer's Dynasty. Um, today, we are thinking about buying a new field. You've got this one here. Um, I think that's co uh, corn on there, is it? Um, and we can we can actually afford this one. Uh, but I am actually going to have a drive around just to see um, if there are any others. Uh, so it's not quite an acre, it's a 0 0.87 acre. Uh, it's only just under 7,000 euros and we have um, just under 9. Um, I can get a bit more money because I've got some uh, grain in the um, silo at back at the farm. So we could in fact, um, you know, maybe get a, a bigger or better field if we wanted to. Uh, but I want to try and keep a certain amount of money um, just in case, you know, because we're going to need probably more food and what have you. We've got the uh, the tomatoes and things like that um, that we can eat and the eggs. But, uh, yeah. Anyway, uh, that field there, I believe that was a lot more expensive. Let's just have a look. I want to try and keep them fairly close to the farm. Uh, enter... Yeah, 14,000. I don't want to use the social points. So, yeah, I'm looking for one that we can actually um, just buy outright. So, yeah, we're not going for that one. Uh, what about that one over there? Oh, we've got a bit of a, a bit of a lag issue there. I don't know what happened there. Hmm. Obviously doesn't like me jumping in and out of uh, different screens. <laughs> But anyway, uh, yeah, so from the last video, uh, you know, th things were really up in the air, you know, uh, what with the game crashing and, and things like that. It was a bit of a bit of a stinker, but, you know, we're, we're back on track. Um, let's check this one. Enter 9,000 year. We could just uh, perhaps go and sell a trailer load of um, grain. We could buy that one. The thing I'm uh, thinking about, you see, we're not too far from the, uh, uh, what do you call it? You know, where you sell the um, uh, your grain. Um, hmm. Let me just have a bring up the map. Where are we? So we're facing this one here. Now, I'm not sure. Well, I'm ho what I'm hoping is, uh, is that if we buy a field that's actually already got crops on it, whether the crops stay there for us, uh, that would be a bonus. Uh, is this a separate field? This is another cornfield, I think. Let's have a look. Yeah, oh, jeez. No, we're we'll not be buying that one. 19,000. No, 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 no. Not just yet, anyway. So, yeah, I think we will probably go for that one over there. Um, and that would be three fields we own. Uh, so yeah, um, and like I said, it's it's right across the way from the uh, from the sale point. The old um... yep, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's what we're going to do. So yeah, we're going uh, we're going to buy this one. I might then go off and uh, get um, get a trailer load of grain sold. Let's have a look then. So, enter 8,000. So, yep, yeah, let's buy it. Sod it. Sod the money. So, we still got just under 2,000 euros left. And the grain is the, uh, the, uh, the crops are still there. Great stuff. Great stuff. So, let's go and get ourselves um, kitted out. Um, now, for this, we need to put the new header on, don't we? If I remember right, I'm hoping it. I'm hoping that's the fact. Um, so yeah, uh, like <laughs> I have played uh, Farm Simulator, and yeah, but it's been been quite a while, so uh, it's getting used to the machinery again. What 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 attachments you need and things like that. So so if you want to bear with me, then I'll go and get all um, kitted out and get uh, and get it started because uh, I want to try and get it all harvested before the seasons change and uh, lose everything so uh, yeah give me a moment and i shall be right back and hey, welcome back right uh i've got the right header <laughs> on the uh the harvester i've got the trailer and what have you over here i've gone round almost once 
um, around the header like kind of thing so I'm just going to go down and get the tractor and the trailer um, to offload the first uh, first load I think it's mace uh, that this uh, this stuff is so I'm not sure what the uh, the value of that is should we have a look uh, so we're on here so yeah it's mace uh, let's go to uh, this where are we let's scroll out a bit uh, a bit, a bit, a bit over here so let's have a look mate yeah maze is not that great 450 euros per ton it's certainly better than wheat uh, i'm not sure if there's any other uh, place on the map at the moment that uh, takes it but i think is what i'm going to be doing is probably doing either peas or canola again uh, once I've done this uh, soy price is 710 peas are, are, are certainly looking good um, might have a look at that see how much I mind saying that money wise yeah now I think we'll uh, we'll stick with the canola for, for, for now right so let's get out of that let's go in there uh, unload our first load this is going to take a pretty uh, a pretty while going around uh, um, this uh, this field so uh, I should probably do all that off of camera anyway so so, so it doesn't bore you uh, too much um, but yeah um, a few things that this game need it does need a bit of optimization you know in regards to especially the video effects you know like let you see you're jumping around all over the place here but um you know for a game that's only been out a, a short time you know it's it's certainly uh, very much uh playable how's that is that okay is that far enough Think we need to go back slightly. I'll do. And V. There we go. Oh yeah, first load going in. So yeah, this is definitely going to be um, canola. I'm gonna be. That's all I'm gonna concentrate on for you know this this harvest. You know, like once uh, we've already done the other two fields that we have. Uh, let's let's uh, turn it on. Is that turned on or is it turned off? Let's try it. No, that's turned off. So let's turn it on. That should be turned on now. You should soon see. Yep. Yeah, we're good. We're good to go. So press the old uh, cruise control so you don't flatten any of your uh, your crops. Going around. So yeah, I think I think with a little bit of um, TLC, um, you've got to expect bugs. You know, like you know, as I said to you uh, in the last video about crashing out and things like that. You've got to expect those sort of things for uh, early access. But uh, it doesn't stop you from thinking, "What a shit! I've done all that work. I've, done, I've spent all those hours playing around and doing that, this, that, and the other, and and that's what happened. It crashes, but." Oh, we're moving too fast. It's me telling you about cruise control, and I'm not taking any of my own advice. But um, but yeah, uh, what else are we we looking for? Yeah, when we get the uh, the girlfriend in the last video, I said you know maybe it, try and put her to work, uh, get her to do the ploughing if we can, and then uh, having babies and letting them grow and getting them to do the cultivating. <laughs> <laughs> that that would be sick. How much we got? Sixty-two percent. Sweet. Should be able to get ooh, get round to the uh, the trailer and uh, offload the next load. So then uh, I'm going to um, I'm going to cut again because, uh, like I said, I don't want to bore you too much with doing things like this. Um, the videos are going to probably be a little bit shorter because uh, you know we're going to start running out of things to do um for now anyway um when they start implementing new stuff 97 oh sorry 83 percent okay we'll empty that come out of there and reverse up a bit yeah they're going to be not not great deal shorter you know what i mean because 
Trust me, there's a lot of work to be done on these fields. Stop. There we go. Fill it up. Fold it up. Uh, so yeah, a lot of work to be done uh, in regards to um, you know harvesting, uh, ploughing. Uh, now I'm not sure because on uh, farm simulator, say if I was to uh, grow maize on here again, now I should in fact only need to cultivate not plow just cultivate because it's the same plant going on the same field um what's your views on that let me know um let's go d there we go so right i'm gonna love you and leave you there for a moment or two um gonna probably go around this a few more times and then start going up and then down and then up and then down so give me a few moments ladies gents and i'll be back with you right then so off we go with our first trailer load of meat uh, let's go and see um, how much the old uh, depot is going to give us for it which is handy because it's just over the road here <clears throat> I might uh, again try and save it once we've harvest all three fields again after this we're going to start maybe see that big ass field there mm -hmm. yeah i wouldn't mind getting that one or that one over there to the right we shall see i'm gonna try yeah the, like i said earlier the uh, the video settings need a little bit of work not a lot um i did have um a comment I think on my last video uh, the guy that was uh, playing it wasn't happy with it he said it looked you know basically looked like a pile of shite but trust me it's not it's not at all it, you know what I mean for for this early in early access yeah it, it, it's working for me it is a lot similar to farm simulator uh, apart from the uh, the real life you know actually going into the houses um, maybe later on getting yourself a, uh, a wife um, but yeah it's going to be great just to follow it just to see uh, how far they're going to go so anyway enough of that let's uh, what would you like actually what would you like to see in the game uh, let me know uh, you know what has uh, let's say what 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 has uh, farm simulator let's say um, or what is it lacking this this is what it's lacking you know the real kind of life aspect of the game getting up in the morning um, collecting the eggs from the chickens feeding the chickens feeding the uh, cows hopefully they bring more animals into this pigs uh, sheep and uh, what have you uh, oh, let's unload this <laughs> talking yeah chatting away and not uh, getting to work uh, yeah that that's something that needs to be done see the way the trailer pulls away yeah that's something that needs to be maybe uh, sorted out because you stood still the trailer shouldn't pull back that way um but yeah what else could they uh, they actually bring in there i think they will probably bring in um, vehicles you know um or traffic they've yeah i mean when you look at it you've got crop uh, destruction so if I was to go across somebody's field um, with, a, with a tractor or something, it would uh, destroy their crops, which obviously means you lose uh, social points and what have you. But uh, we're behaving ourselves. We're not, we're not doing that. Uh, you've got the withering of, um, of crops, because like I said yes, uh, in my last video, um, I fast-forwarded, if you like, rested for too long, went outside, check the fields all the grain uh, sorry all the um, all the crops had uh, withered away so it's there yeah you know I mean and like I said for, for this for, for such an early access kind of game that's uh, that's pretty damn good because there's a lot of games out there that you can uh, that you can um, sort of like access early and they are just piles of crop uh, piles of crap if you like is that okay there it's gonna have to be right so let's uh, jump back in here she is uh, fully unloaded so let's uh, start her up and get back to work 
Right, so basically we got about two and a half or just over two and a half um, trailer loads from from that field. So uh, we haven't done too bad but when you look at the amount of money we got. When, when we've uh, unloaded this half load here, we'll have a look to see how much money we got. Now I think the money that we, we've just earned would have actually paid for that field. So that's, that is a bonus. Um, so financially I think we're pretty well set uh, so and I think I've got enough uh, seeds and fertilizer back at the farm um, to um, uh, for that for that particular field so yeah we're, we're, we're pretty good and then hopefully the uh, the uh, price of uh, the uh, canola doesn't drop dramatically because if it does I will be well um, but yeah, we should see, see how it goes. Uh, I've been playing around with my video settings um, uh, a little bit. I've got it on max at the moment. I've turned one or two little things off, uh, like the sun rays and things like that, because uh, that does get a little bit um, uh, in your face, if you like. So let's unload this. So we're just shy of the amount. How much was it? It was about... Was it six thousand something? Other we we paid for it, something like that anyway. But look, we got six thousand eight hundred and forty uh, euros, so that's that's not too shabby. So we're uh, we're okay to uh, get food and what have you if we need it tem uh, temporarily. Um, I'm going to go back to the farm now. I'm going to go and get the plow and plow that field. Ooh, I'm looking forward to that, aren't I? Yeah. Um, Get it cultivated, get it uh, fertilised, get it seeded, and then we'll have three fields of our own with uh, granola on it. And then I think the crop after that, one or two of the fields are going to have to be uh, wheat, so we can actually um, get some cows. And yeah, I'm 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 pretty stoked on the game at the moment, ladies and gents. Got to be fair, you know. Yesterday's, or well, actually the other day. Uh, with the crashing, as I keep saying, you've got to take that sort of thing on the chin. Um, but what do I want to do? I'll take this trailer back. I think I've left the uh, the harvester at that farm there for now. Um, but later on, I'll uh, take it because it's quite handy doing that because you can sort of like teleport from uh, one vehicle to another, which is uh, you know the same sort of thing you can do on farm sim. Um, so are they copycatting? Uh, that, that's the question. Now I don't think so. They, they, you know, what different things could you bring into a farm simulator kind of game? Uh, uh, there, there's not, you know, there's not a great deal. I would like to see later on, like, um, where's my farm? I would like to see later on like a, uh, a dog, because every farmer needs a dog, uh, especially if they implement the sheep um, and things like that. Um, and obviously taking care of it and uh, making sure it's uh, fed and walked and things like that. You know, it's silly things uh, that we'd like to see. I would like to see uh, apple uh, plum trees. Uh, because when, in my day of uh, like working on farms, that's what it was all about, you see. It was like, um, get up in the morning, and the farm that we were working on, that's basically really all he had. No, so tell a lie, he did have vegetable fields, but most of his work were for plums, damsons, and things like that. Uh, it was great. It was, You know, I was only young, um, but... Uh, I'm reminiscing here, but it, it was it was a great feeling just to be able to get up in the morning and, and go out and you're working out in the open air. You know you've got none, uh, you've got nobody really hassling you. The farmer just let us get on. If we didn't work, we didn't get paid. Uh, so that was like his kind of attitude, um, which is fair enough, and that's the way the world is. But uh, yeah, I'd like to see apple trees or any kind of fruit trees in the game. Uh, a little bit more in the house. Uh, yeah, I mean, like you can't actually access anything in 
in these I mean you've got a stove uh, if you have a look in the uh, in my inventory here you've got hamburger uh, where do you make it you know what I mean uh, like obviously we're going to need cows and things like that but you can't actually access anything inside the ca in in the house other than the bed or the uh, storage room down in the basement um, you, you know I mean you've got all the doors um, that you can actually they've moved things around in here haven't they so I'm pretty sure there were things in the center of the room I think they may have Oh yeah, they, I know they did uh, move that bed. Uh, there was like a, a baby's crib or cot there and it was glitched inside the bed. They moved that, which is good. Um, but yeah, getting up in the morning, coming downstairs, having yourself a bit of a wash, uh, turning yourself around, sitting your ass here, waiting for the wife to bring you your breakfast. Go outside, start the day by getting the eggs for the uh, from the uh, chickens um, feeding the cattle the sheep if they bring them in the pigs as well and things like that um, yeah that, that'd, that'd be great um, well I think so anyway and maybe on a Sunday afternoon when you've had your dinner you, you know, I mean Sunday should be a day of rest so basically yeah bring a couple of public houses in you know pub or a bar if you want to call it that um, and then yeah go down and uh, socialize with um, other characters in the game um, you know uh, just telling a few tales having a bit of a laugh and a joke and things actually just go and rest um, so yeah that's the sort of things I would like to see in the game and then uh, you know when you walk around the house it's all gray you know it's uh, there's not a great deal of uh, detail but hopefully they you know they will uh, let's say allow you to uh, go to the store and buy furniture for your house you know uh, uh, a nice widescreen tv <laughs> instead of that old box you remember these old kind of tvs oh geez yeah they're fucking heavy as well sorry about the language <laughs> but uh yeah they were pretty damn heavy um and not being able to sort of like just walk over everything you know that that would be good you'd have to sort of seriously walk around it like that um but yeah, I, I so, yeah, put wall uh, paintings on the walls and and what have you. I mean, you've got the light system, it all works. Actually, I don't think we're going to be using a lot of energy if we left the lights on, but it may cause a bit of lag. So what we got there? I'm running at about 60 FPS. So let's turn the light off, and it's still the same, exactly the same. So the lights on here don't actually affect the FPS on most games they do uh, it's still around about 60 and that's two lights on so i'll leave the lights on i think um uh, yeah cool uh unless they're gonna start charging me um for the electricity that i'm using uh so yeah that's uh, that's a few things that i would like to see uh what about outside in here right the grass itself that needs cutting so i would like to see a push mower i think i may have mentioned that uh, in the past uh, rather than just the strimmer we've got the strimmer uh, but a push mower for these little areas um, I know there's a uh, there's a, a mower in the shed and there's also a mower at the um, a vehicle um, uh, department uh, but the mower that we've got here it just doesn't work very well I tried it on the grass here no this is it in, in, inside here I, I believe it's a mower anyway let's uh let's have a look like oh, that's just telling me about the fields it doesn't tell me anything about this uh this machine but it, it certainly looks like an old-fashioned kind of mower um what could we have in here um i don't know some kind of like a, a better stackable sort of area in here for your bales um i got bales up there look Let's see up on the top there um so yeah you know but like this is ideal to park your uh, harvester not bad at all uh these little sheds what can you actually like i've got the plow in that one um i could put the fertilizer or something in this one because the fertilizer actually no the fertilizer is in here and the cedar uh 
so as far as room is concerned we i think we've got plenty enough of it i'd like a few more hand tools perhaps uh on the shelves uh where do we get the fishing rod now they, they it might not actually be implemented just yet because I've been up to a few uh, a few characters that have been fishing and all they say is, no, I'm too busy, you know, piss off kind of thing. Um, so, yeah, I'd like, uh, well, you know, where do we find the fishing rod? Um, but, yeah, and upstairs even. Uh, let's have a quick look upstairs. Open the door. I might chat, have a play around with my uh, sensitivity on my mouse as well because I think it's a little bit, woo, a little bit too wild. Uh, so up here, now this is an area, I, I'm not sure because this machine, this pipe here, it's connected to something downstairs. Uh, oh, I'm getting hungry now. Um, let's take a few eggs on board. Oh, give me a second. Okay, apologies for that. Wife just walked through the door. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, uh, it, this is a, like a, a bit of a an extended storage area for grain or something. Um, if you look down at, at the machine, this this room here is doing absolutely nothing. So again, you could use it for tools, um, crafting area of some kinds. Uh, so yeah, let's have a quick look out here. Uh, so grain storage. Grain storage is also native to your soil. Oh, silos. Uh, you can store other grains here. Only one sort of grain can be stored here. So, yeah. But the trailer that we've got, I'm not sure if you just can pull up to it or something like that and either offload or, or load i'm not sure so we'll have to have a look into that later on uh graphic wise what do you think uh, are these settings okay for you because i don't you know i don't want to keep messing around with it uh it's on ultra at the moment well i say ultra but everything is on high and uh, see you've got trees here uh like a bit of an orchard uh if you could interact with the trees uh pick the fruit off them or or what have you that would be cool that would be very very cool um yeah I, I would really like that being able to uh maybe um paint your fences uh paint the buildings if you wanted to uh just to tidy them up because look now because we repaired that um at the beginning of the game you've got that uh light gray uh patch there you know tidy it all up put new doors on the uh on the sheds uh, rather than having uh, wooden ones, have like these metal ones, modern day. Same with the roof. There are barns, uh, actually farms around on the map that have got uh, metal uh, roofs rather than wood. Um, and on that roof there, as you can see, you know, you've got the red bit on the end, which is uh, so you can uh, keep your hay dry. But why not have the same roof all the way across? Uh huh. Yeah there's a dog there's a kennel you see so maybe they might be implementing uh dogs or something later on oh i do hope so have a little dog you know yapping away here oh that would be cool the sound effects in the game is great last night i was playing and you could hear the owls in the background oh that was good see they got a, a bird's um a bird box up there so maybe they'll have uh uh, pigeons or something like that that you could uh, own and tame or, or what have you and sell and stuff like that yeah, yeah. there's loads of options you know uh, possibilities within this kind of game uh, and as i said with the chickens earlier on or in my last episode i would like to be able to go to the store and buy more uh, but like i said you might have to get more social points or something like that and to get you know to get to that state so uh yeah we've we've done a little bit off cut you know well, we've done a little bit today uh we've got ourselves a new field so that's three fields we've got they're all going to be uh, granola and so we should be able to get a fair amount of money i want to get that new uh, that bigger tractor now what about uh money uh i would like the option to be able to sort of like go onto another map start all over again but have like a creative mode where you could get the money go out and buy the tractors just to try them out because at the moment the way things are you've really got to work for it 
Um, the tractor itself is like a hundred plus thousand uh, euros. Uh, you're going to be. It's going to take some time. With just with those three fields, you're going to be looking at. Uh, let, let's say you get ten thousand for 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 the harvest off of those. That's only thirty thousand. So you're going to have to do that a fair few times to get it. Buy another field after we've harvested those. You know, bloody bloody bloody. Anyway, we'll see how it goes. So anyway, if you like today's episode, if you would be so kind to leave me a bit of a like. Um, if you're new to the channel, hello and so uh, please subscribe. Uh, any comment that you would like to leave, please feel free and uh, share your views on uh, you know what I've uh, suggested. You know about bringing certain things in. You know. Uh, all those things help because you never know the developer of the game might fall upon my videos and play them and think yeah that's not a bad idea yeah we'll, we'll see how it goes anyway so until the next episode then ladies gents and boys and the girls and my dear old friend Diz bye bye for now bye bye